Hey guys, Dylan Grabowski here with Neo News Today. Today we're talking with Mongol, the CEO and founder of YesCoin. How's it going? Thank you. Thanks for ha having me here. Absolutely. So you're going to be a new project in the Neo ecosystem. Mm -hmm. So can you tell us a little bit about YesCoin sure. and what it is that you're looking to do? Sure. So basically everything started uh, about a year ago. Uh, I am an IT finance specialist at one of the biggest international organizations. I, I don't want to mention it, mm -hmm. but I think you know. Um, at this organization, they, at that, on that day, they organized a seminar about blockchain and many agencies uh, around the world you know, attended the seminar and then that's when I learned the blockchain potential that can change the world. Mm -hmm. On that day, I, I was so excited. I went home, set up a uh, mining machine, opened my crypto wallet account <laughs> and it, I learned that it's, it's not easy. Mm -hmm. I, I have my master's degree in computer science it took me a few days to get mm. things to work and I'm afraid I'm going to mess up and like that. Absolutely. Yes. And because as a parent, the sa child safety is my, you know, very important. Mm -hmm. uh, and the internet itself is not safe right. for child right now. It's not safe for adults. For anyone. So my goal is how can I use blockchain technology to make it safer mm -hmm. for my child in the new generations and for everyone else. Mm. That's when everything started. Then I, I you know, talk with friends and see if we can use blockchain to, to make the internet safer. Mm -hmm. So we got a friend who helping and then we got funded and that's how we started. Very cool. Yes. So what's sort of beyond um, just incorporating blockchain mm -hmm. and creating a, a, a level of safety on the internet, what, is the, what else is part of the vision of YesCoin? Mm -hmm. um, are you talking about the current or future? Or do you think about what, what work we, we've been doing? Uh, yeah, just, just to clarify. Yeah, yeah. So let's talk about a little bit of the work that you've done so far and mm -hmm. what's your vision for going forward? What's the roadmap look oh, like? Oh, sure. Basically, uh, we already developed Chrome extension. Mm -hmm. And we right now, there is a basically open source database of, of people who, who consider like scam, mm -hmm. so like a scam database mm -hmm. that we, we create an API and and when people, when someone try to send a cryptocurrency to a specific address, mm -hmm. right now it's only available in Ethereum at the moment, uh, the Chrome extension will alert the user that this ad address exists in the scam database, you might be careful, mm -hmm. you should be careful about that. And so are so, you ma building and maintaining this database? Correct, correct. Okay. So this, this one quick step, but can have a quick win. If you can save some people to send, you know, thousands of dollars to, to, to scammer, that already make my day. Absolutely. So that's the first uh, product that we already launched. Um, it's, you can download from, you know, go to the URL chrome2.justcoin.com. And the product that we also launched already is basically cryptocurrency, um, a crypto wallet for NEP5. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. uh, but we modify it to make it easier. We love Neon Wallet, I'm, I'm, I will not, uh, just get me wrong, but it still requires a ten, like, couple of steps to get into specific asset, specific mm -hmm. token. So we make it simpler by uh, utilizing Google login and Facebook login. Mm -hmm. So people who have Google, Facebook account, they, they can click on a button and then the, the wallet will create uh, a wallet. Crypt, no, Nep5 wallet for based for off the of their login credentials using Facebook or and then, Gmail. Uh, yes, because uh, we can use full name and email already. Mm -hmm. that, and and after that, that user will have an option to to save their private key or write it down. So this is purely decentralized wallet and mm -hmm. it's safe and easy onboarding for for new users. Awesome. Have you had the chance to speak with other projects who are building wallets in the ecosystem while you've been here at DevCon? Um, I, I talked to other projects on, sec on security sites, mm -hmm. how to make it safer because security is my concern. Absolutely. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Great. Um, so in addition to the Chrome extension and the wallet, mm -hmm. you're also talking about launching a decentralized exchange. Yes, yes. Could you tell us a little bit more about what your vision is for that and sure. what you want to do? In the, in the process of me trying to learn cryptocurrency, I open uh, multiple wallets in dif different exchanges and you see that it's a pain that, you know, uh, it's not easy, it's not user-friendly, and, and everyone knows that uh, centralized exchange is not safe mm -hmm. right now. Um, and and we, the decentralized model is, is more secure. 
and we want to make it better by combi combining the secu security from decentralized exchange. Mm -hmm. But things that are not important, we put it off chain, so make it faster. So okay. we so we got speed and security at the same time. Absolutely. And with forward, we want to make it so easy because the um, private key management is, is also a, an issue. People have millions of dollars that they're lost because they forgot their password. Yeah. So we want to use biometrics ID to help people uh, access their, their wallets to, mm. to their personal ID. Through like a thumbprint? Yes, or? yes. Fingerprint, facial, mm -hmm. uh, voice. Cool. Yeah. Awesome. And so where are you looking at um, locating the decentralized exchange? Are you looking to locate in like Liechtenstein or are you looking to locate in another country? Uh, because I'm, I am Thai mm -hmm. and we have uh, strong connections with uh, people in Thailand mm -hmm. and we already started a conversation with Thai SEC. Uh, we, we would like to, to start uh, to get a license for cryptocurrency exchange in Thailand first. Mm. Awesome. Yes. So we've got to cover a lot of great things about your project uh -huh. today. Is yeah. there anything else that you would like to tell our viewers about Yescoin that sure, we might not have sure. covered? If, if you see that, um, you can see that identity management, it, it is everything. Like for government concerns about you know KYC, AML, you know your customer and time money laundering. Mm -hmm. Because you cannot identify people who are doing transactions in cryptocurrency. And we want to be a gated community to make sure that people in our community are safe. Mm -hmm. They can do online transaction safe. We want, we want to uh, secure community uh, for everyone. Mm -hmm. And we want it to turn into digital data marketplace that uh, think, think of the way Uber is basically you know, uh, sharing economy of taxi. Yeah. And Airbnb is sharing economy of, of empty house and, mm -hmm. and bedroom. And just quite will be sharing economy of your personal data. Very cool. Yes. Well, it's exciting to hear about the Neo blockchain expanding into projects that are in um, countries that aren't just in Europe mm -hmm. and the United States. So I very much look forward to following the progress. And the last thing, I forgot to oh, mention that absolutely. because we we are uh, having a, an airdrop program mm. that we would like to uh, airdrop to uh, every Neo wallet holder. Mm -hmm. So, you know, please check uh, our. Uh, Website is register.yescoin.com. Mm -hmm. Yes, and yes, yes is spelling it Y E Z. What? Yes, yes, coin. yes, yeah. coin. So, if mm -hmm. folks want to get in contact with you, what are some great ways that they can reach out to you? Yes, basically, uh, we are on Telegram, on YouTube, on Facebook. Mm -hmm. It's very simple. It's youtube.yescoin.com, facebook.yescoin.com, telegram.yescoin.com. Twitter.yescoy.com, everything is yescoy.com. Awesome. Yes. Well, thank you very much for your time today. You can follow, learn more about the projects that we've been interviewing and what's been going on here at DevCon on our website at neonewstoday.com. And you can also follow along on our Twitter and YouTube accounts, follow Neo News Today. So thank you very much for taking the time to chat with us today. Thank you, Dylan.